Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Safi Sprocket and today we are on episode three of me trying to build a motorcycle carriage. <laughs> I am not having a great time at all. I am not having a great time at all. I'm like super struggling with these cabinets and it's not because of my incompetence and you guys all know that I will be the first person to put my hand up when I can't do something but the, let me show you guys, let me show, where is it? Oh, where have I put the instructions? I need to show you how utterly ridiculous these instructions are. Like, I've never, I know that's the wrong one. Okay, I think I've been the other instructions, but long story short, Sealy have produced instructions for their unit. Now you can tell that these instructions used to be a4 size and what they've done is they have shrunk them down to a5 size and then reprinted them so none of the text that goes with the instructions is actually text it's just blurry dots like you can't read this and at first i was like oh my god this is such a nightmare and i thought it's fine it's fine i can go online and i can like download the instructions online no because the original file for the instructions is also compressed. So basically these have no instructions and I have been losing my mind and we're like three weeks in and I just managed to build a cabinet and I just, <sighs> but it's fine. It's now built, it's now built. <sighs> so yeah, that's all down. <laughs>
Okay, so I finally finished building the rest of the cabinets in the garage. I think I'm like coming down with something. Um, I've had like a really sore throat all day and I've just been, oh, I've been feeling so ill. I think I'm like, I'm coming down with like a cold or a flu, I don't know. It's not great, it's not great guys. <laughs> but the cabinets are built, I've got half the floor done. But I've got a bit of a predicament. I have loan bikes on the way because I thought I'd be done by now. And I'm not done. So I'm not going to be able to cut any more floor while there's ex excess bikes in here. So, and I don't feel great. I don't feel great at all. But I'm going to have to like persevere. It's not good. I need to sleep. Okay, so first things first, I've not finished building the garage yet, <laughs> but I have already started accepting bikes for reviews. So a little bit of chaos going on there. The other thing is that it's still relatively cold outside and I really want my heated jacket. So we've got a little screwdriver. I'm gonna take the heated wiring off my SV. <sighs> Hello, Rocket. Ooh. Oh gosh, a bit of a building today. <laughs>
So, I don't know why, like I could have just wheeled the dolly outside, moved the bike out, wheeled the dolly back in and then rode the bike onto it. But I was just convinced that I was going to reverse the bike onto the Onto the dolly, sorry, that's what I did. I reversed it after what was probably like the longest point turn ever. A bajillion point turn. We've got it there, we've got it there. Got it there. Got it there. I'm making some progress on the garage. I have been so ill over the last week, but I'm making some progress finally. I've got the cabinet built up now. We've got our little lower cabinets. I've started sorting out the pegboards to the wall. These smaller cabinets are going to go up high on the walls. I don't know if you noticed, there's currently like a gap down the right hand side, but I'm planning on solving this by basically ripping the worktop off the cabinets and then installing an L-shaped one, just so I can make you know full use of this little additional space here. Also, it gives me the you know the ability to put a little little TV there as well. So you know it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty good. Now I do have someone coming to rewire the garage next week. Thank the Lord, which is really really more exciting than it sounds because once the garage has been rewired, we can then start installing all the tech, which I'm gonna be honest, is like more exciting than this. Like I've got some really cool plans lined up. I've almost finished the floor. I've got like two panels left to cut. So I'm gonna try and get those done this evening. Whenever they get done, I don't know, because I'm off to London bike show soon. So, <laughs> but we're getting there, we're getting there. There's currently three bikes in here. It's uh, not very spacious. It's very, very cramped. I think when, you know, the lone bikes are gone and it's just my bike in here, I don't think it's gonna be any issue, but for time being, oh, trying to like squish around the bikes is such a nightmare. Anyway, I need to start going and packing up for the show. So if you guys are at the London Bike Show, I'll see you there. And if not, ride safe, stay crazy. My name's Safi Sprocket, signing off.